Do have some new information this morning on that mass shooting in downtown Memphis. We know that eight people were shot Sunday morning and Fox 13's Carolyn Serta joining us live from the newsroom. Anyone charged in this yet, Carolyn? At this point, no, but that is what oh, Memphis police are, are hoping to get some leads on releasing this brand new video that we have for you, showing a different angle of this shooting. This is a closer look at this video. Memphis police releasing this overnight. This is a, an angle from across the street from the Hooters on Peabody and Third Street. And here's where you can see the people there scattering, of course, as that gun sh uh, gunfire rings out. It, if you look at the top left, though, of your corner screen there, you see that one car is zipping by as this is all happening, followed by two other cars. Now, Memphis police also uh, released this picture of the car. They say the suspects, the person or persons were inside when they fired those shots. They say they drove away in this black infinity SUV. So take a good look. Now, we have been showing you a different angle uh, since this shooting Sunday morning. This one right here from above Hooters, you can see the people scattering there. Uh, again, this happened 2.30 Sunday morning. Officers saw, they say, cars doing donuts, blocking that intersection off of South BB King and Peabody. Shortly after that is when they say the gunfire rang out. We know that eight people in total were struck by bullets. Also, the Hampton Inn, uh, the, also the uh, Hooters were struck by bullets as well. All of those victims uh, at, at last check expected to be okay. But again, at this point, no one's been captured. No identity of any suspects. So again, if you have any information on, again, this black SUV Infinity, any information about the shooting, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at 528-CASH. Ernie? You know, police say it's an ongoing investigation. Hopefully something will break in that soon. Carolyn Sert in the newsroom. It is 7.